सो हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू यूर पीडिया ग्लोबल वीकली न्यूज लेटर एडिशन टूडे वी आर हेयर ऑन द यूट्यूब चैनल ऑफ यूर पीडिया एजुकेशन सो यू नो इन अवर वीकली न्यूज लेटर एडिशन वी शेयर विद यू पीपल द लिस्ट ऑफ टॉप पी एच डी पोजिशन विद फुली फंडिंग एंड स्कॉलरशिप इन डिफरेंट यूनिवर्सिटी इन डिफरेंट काउनर ऑफ द वर्ल्ड सो दिस वीडियो इज गोइंग टू बी हेल्पफुल फॉर ऑल दो एस्पायरिंग कैंडिडेट whose future aspiration is long term objective is to become a researcher and they want to continue their higher education be it msc ms ms by research ms by coursework m engineering phd and direct phd from the abroad and that too from the top us ranking university or ivy league institutions so you know when we talk about the international phd position or ms position so the process is bit different from the we have admission process in the india so it's not merely a process of filling the application form there you need to prepare and draft some supplementary document like sop cv motivation letter cover letter diversity essay personal statement academic statement letter of recommendation okay there are so many different kind of document asked by the different university and these are some standard document which are asked most of the places so this is the space where your pedia global mentor can help you people because if you want to make sure that your probability of getting selected and getting funding is very high then you need to present yourself best how you can present yourself best through those document those document provide you an opportunity to present yourself best while writing it means you need to write those document in well appropriate and relevant way so those are the deciding factor and you can see here the your pedia global this is our youtube channel so if you are looking forward to get the latest or useful update related to scholarship related to deadlines of the fall 2024 deadline related to spring 2024 and various research opportunity you can follow our youtube channel your pedia global this is exclusively for the international study purpose you can see you can prepare with us for the gre exam there is a requirement of the gre exam and you can prepare with us for the ielts there are different opportunity in canada usa italy and different places similarly you can see information related to pgdm and how to apply that is your pedia global admission guide module where we share with you the step wise breakdown of the application process so guys this was our basically you know platform where we keep on sharing the latest update so follow us subscribe our youtube channel your pedia global and these are all our services where we assist the student and these are our few of the results or menti milestone for more exploration and for more detail and for more such menti you can visit our website your pedia global also So now continuing the discussion further for today's agenda we have the first phd opportunity in the electrical engineering that is for the electrical student and for the student whose background is power electronics or power engineering and they love to study power electronics solid state physics solid state device this is coming from the rensselaer polytechnic institute and the research area is wide band gap semiconductor and wide band gap based power electrical or power electronics reliability and system duration is 3.5 year there is not a specific date it means once they find a suitable candidate they are going to over it so apply as soon as possible yes it's a fully funded position and they put some prerequisite candidate must have first class degree in electrical engineering with good exposure of power semiconductor and power electronics and then you can see for electrical engineering second position is in the cornell university usa The research area is optimization machine learning power system skill and interest in power and energy system transportation system and IoT application. Duration is 3.5 year yet there is no specific date yes it's a fully funded position and prerequisite candidate must have a very good hands on exposure in power engineering and having first class degree in electrical engineering having good knowledge of data analytics and machine learning. and then we have the third position in electrical engineering for phd mississippi state university research area is machine learning for radar and remote sensing and it's a four year program last date is 15 december yes it's a fully funded prerequisite candidate are expected to have bachelor and ms are preferred in electrical engineering with high grades prior course work and research in 
सिग्नल प्रोसेसिंग मशीन लर्निंग एंड रिमोट सेंसिंग इज रिक्वायर्ड नेक्स्ट वी हैव इन द इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियरिंग फॉर पीएचडी इन एमएस कैरलेटन यूनिवर्सिटी ओटावा कनाडा रिसर्च एरिया इज कंट्रोल एंड रोबोटिक्स फॉर पीएचडी इट्स 3.5 टू 4 ईयर फॉर एमएससी 1 टू 1.5 एंड 2 ईयर नॉट अ स्पेसिफिक डेट यस इट्स अ फुली फंडेड पोजीशन एंड देयर पुट सम प्रीरिक्विजिट for phd applicant they are recommended to have a very good hands on knowledge of the control system linear non linear adaptive control optimal control control stability probability and statistics along with the mathematics and for msc applicant they are recommended to have background in one or more of the following topic like linear non linear control linear algebra mathematic deep learning and machine learning next up we have the last position for electrical engineering university of the southern denmark sdu Research area is onboard computing for autonomous drone application duration 3.5 and last date is 10th of September yes it's a fully funded position prerequisite the applicant must hold an MSc degree in robotics drone digital electronics autonomous system or related field and hardware skill in digital electronics hardware programming like FPGA MPSOC and hardware architecture is required software skill in C C++ Python and ROS good academic skill and writing skill is required Next up we have for the civil engineering first is technical university of the Denmark research areas data enabled heating optimization in apartment buildings yes this is the one of the current real world issues so very good topic to work with duration is 3.5 year last date is 8th of September yes it's a fully funded position prerequisite and undergraduate degree in mechanical or civil engineering with minimum of 8 cgp is required <laughs> Second is for civil engineering PhD university name is Oxford Brookes University UK a research area is visualization of digital twin data in operation and maintenance of buildings duration 3.5 year last date is 27th of September yes it's a fully funded position and prerequisite a first class master degree with minimum of 8 cgpa in built environment or engineering related discipline is required Next we have for civil engineering research area is machine learning guided design of efficient sustainable for hydrogen photocatalysis university is university of warwick england duration is 4 year last date is 1st of march and yes it's a fully funded position and requirement an undergraduate degree in civil or mechanical with 8 cgpa next we have for the civil engineering university of canterbury new zealand research area is transportation decision making and uncertainty duration 3.5 year there is not a specific deadline application accepted all year around and it's a fully funded position prerequisite background in transportation engineering civil engineering industrial engineering or applied mathematics computer science or similar area is required next up we have for the civil engineering cardiff school of engineering uk the research area is kinetics and mechanism of mineral waste carbonization duration 3.5 year last date is 1st of march it's a self funded position means you need to find at your own some external source of funding and there are many other external funding options available what are those there are lots of video available on the urpedia global youtube channel so prerequisite an undergraduate degree in civil or related discipline iel score of 6.5 overall with minimum of 6 in e sub sections <laughs> now for mechanical engineering phd there is lobberg university the name of university and research area is effective human robot collaboration duration is 3.5 year last date is 18th of september yes it's a fully funded position prerequisite applicant should have or expect to achieve at least 8 cgpa degree or equivalent in engineering in mechanical computer science related discipline and second position we have for mechanical engineering in monash university Research area is the development of physics constraint reduced order model of thermally driven flow duration 3.5 year there is not specific date but applications are open throughout the year once they find a suitable candidate it will be open so don't miss the deadline don't delay the opportunity right and it's a fully funded position prerequisite and undergraduate degree in mechanical discipline iel score of 7 overall with minimum of 6.5 in the e sub section Next for mechanical PhD Brunel University London research area is extending useful metallic product lifetime through manufacturing duration 3.5 year last date is 25th of September yes it's a fully funded position prerequisite of first class degree with minimum of 7 cgpa in material science or mechanical engineering and then again the mechanical engineering university name is Luxembourg Institute of Technology research area is the development of laser based liquid flow diagnostics 
duration 3.5 year there is not a specific deadline yes it's a fully funded position prerequisite and undergraduate degree in mechanical or civil discipline i'll score of 7 overall with minimum of 6.5 in each subsections last mechanical opportunities university name is labag university research area is novel solution in lightweight high performance polymer gearing for robotics duration 3.5 year last date is 6th of september yes it's a fully funded position and prerequisite applicant must have an engineering in mechanical or related branch with minimum of its cgpa now we have few opportunity for computer science first is the university of warwick the research area is integrating machine learning and multi-scale modeling for simulating fracture in materials with uncertainties duration 3.5 year last it is 30th of september yes it's a fully funded position and prerequisite first class degree with minimum of 8 cgpa in applied mathematics data science and computer science next second we have university of halt for Trier. for computer science research area is enhancing adoptive control system performance using advanced machine learning technique duration 3.5 year last date is 4th of september Yes, it's a fully funded position and prerequisite of first class master engineering degree with minimum of its GP in maths and computer science. Next third position we have for computer science University of Exeter. Research area is artificial intelligence enabled active matter materials. Duration 3.5 year last date is 31st of August which is very nearby. Yes, it's a fully funded position prerequisite and undergraduate degree in computer science or related discipline IL score of 7 overall with minimum of 6.5 in each of his subsection. Last opportunity for computer science we are having University of Bristol. It's in the artificial intelligence for monitoring purpose. Duration 3.5 year. Last date is 8th of September. Yes, it's a fully funded position and a very good undergraduate degree in computer science related field with good knowledge in artificial intelligence related subject is required. So guys, these were the opportunity around 20 opportunity for four major disciplines of engineering like uh, civil engineering, electrical engineering, mechanical engineering and computer science engineering. So if you want to listen the same opportunity for other discipline or other department, put down in the comment section the name of discipline and any other kind of requirement you are stuck with or you need assistance in your foreign application process as i discussed in the beginning of this video you can mention down in the comment or feel free to connect with the executive and mentors of the europedia global i told you in the beginning that to apply for phd in the international university is not merely a filling application form there is a proper process in stages you need to follow First, you need to start making connection with the professor or supervisor who are currently actively contributing in those research area in which you want to pursue the PhD. Start making connection with them and then see how the process goes on. Might be they will ask you for a very small brief interaction. There you want to know in more detail about your research experiences and past project. So what all kind of assistance you need in the different stages, be it in the document drafting, be it in the visa interview, be it in the selection of that, you know, different scholarships. So you can knock the door of your PDA Global Mentors. So we wish you all the best. Thanks a lot.